Hey, welcome to the Geek Retreat Podcast, the number one podcast for casual geeks. This is episode 35. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother. Episode 35. My name is Steven. I am your host, and this is Mick. Hey, man. <laughs> <laughs> and that's Jason. I feel the need. The need for speed. Yes, are gonna, yes, Steve. Are you going to high five yeah. me? Yeah. Oh. Right. That's from Top Gun. Hello. Yes, it is, sir. And then they high five each other on the deck, on the yes, flight sir. deck. That's right. Jason, you've been giving us like. Can you give us like some a little bit harder than that, but a little easier than the ones you've been giving us in the past? <laughs> you can't please me. So we're trying to find some kind of medium <laughs> for you. Like... Yeah, find something in the middle where uh, where I know everything. Okay. <laughs> <I'm supposed> to... <laughs> that sounds so bad. <laughs> well, hey, welcome. Make to... me look smart. <laughs> yeah, make Jason. me look good. That's your job. Oh, that sounds terrible. Uh, <laughs> well, welcome to the podcast. This is the casual podcast for the casual geek. Um, we are just three coworkers who love to get together every week, talk about what's new in gaming and entertainment and TV. And so we're back again and, uh, not much has been happening. Um, I watched a movie this, I watched a movie. Something did happen. Wait, what did you watch? I watched a movie guys. What did you watch? I watched it. It's on Netflix. Straight to Netflix. Who's famous for going straight to Netflix? Adam Sandler. Netflix, Netflix originals. It's Adam Sandler. <laughs> I watched uh. Hubie, Hubie Halloween. How was it? I wanted to watch it. <laughs> it's really good, actually. It it's really good. funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was really funny. So I want to back up to a few episodes ago, probably like 10 episodes ago now. No, not that many. Yeah, it was a while. It was, it was a while a back. It was, it was a lot. It was a while back. I read an article from Adam Sandler that stated that if he did not get an Oscar nominee for Uncut Gems, he was going to follow it up with a really terrible movie. And then we got Hubie Halloween that dropped like two days ago. And it like in all movie standards, it's a terrible movie. He has the dumbest accent the whole time. He, he talked like this the whole time. <laughs> but it's so good. It's so good. And there's like there's a cameo from one of his very Listen, first. Adam movies. Sandler always has some kind of weird yeah. talking dialect anyway. Yeah, not all he's, the time. Not all the time. Now, now, uh, uh, is it the like a little Nickly? Little Nickly. Little Nickly. Uh, little Nicky. Little, 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 uh, <laughs> little no, he tastes just fine. Um, is it like, <laughs> like comparable? <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long time since I've seen Little, little Nicky. Uh, so I don't even remember what that movie's about. I know. No, it's. I don't think so. No. You have to ask somebody else. I mean, I think like I, the funny funniness of it. I honestly have only seen that movie like I'll check one it out. Time. I'll yeah, watch check it. it out. Yeah, and and let us know. But yeah, yeah, yeah. It was uh, just real dumb comedy, and he gets hurt a lot in it. Like he, a lot of uh, like he. There's some wire work where he t- takes some really bad hits, really bad falls, and it's really funny. Um, but you gotta check it out, Jason. I want you no. to watch it. Watch it. No. How, what would, what do I have to do? I gotta, I gotta see a trailer. I, I'll look at a trailer and I'll see if I can stand no, it. And no, if I can stand no, it. No, just go in blind. That's how no, I, no, you please go in blind. There's so much other movies I'd rather be watching. That's no, gonna be a terrible on. movie. I'm just, I'd that's, rather. So, you know how like we have it. our new series of me playing a game that's a scary game and you guys enjoy it of like yeah. my, your enjoyment of me being scared of a game? Yeah. Can we have a series where Jason watches all the dumb Adam Sandler movies and he and Mick get to have the enjoyment of him being miserable through it? That would be funny. We should like do that. It. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's make it happen. Let's so do it. Well, I mean, I, I want to figure it out, Jason. What's it going to take? Can we get you just to go well, in blind on it? Uh, okay. All right. All right. Uh, what if I told you Ray so, Le- What if I told you Ray Liotta's in this movie? That doesn't. That doesn't help it at all. Why not? <laughs> He's why was it, why would Ray Liotta? Because him? he's a serious actor who uh, has done an amazing job and been in the, some of the greatest movies ever. 
It doesn't matter if he's a serious actor if he's in a movie like this. That means right. he's going to not be serious or he's going to be trying to be serious, but it's like it's meant to be jokey. I tell you what, this is a it is a Halloween movie and so people are dressed like they're like they're dressing up for Halloween, you know? Ray Liotta whenever he's on camera looks like he's being dressed up for Halloween. He wears the most eyeliner and mascara and like um what's the stuff <laughs> that you put on before all that it like makes your face it takes all the wrinkles foundation. out of your face foundation i think <laughs> we don't wives are gonna <laughs> you should know this <laughs> yeah powder powder yeah they whatever oh, powder. He, like he looks like you could very well tell there's makeup on his face and he like for his normal part and i think he just looks old i think he's just super old and he needs that much makeup like uh have you ever seen um who plays uh the wit guy in Iron Man 2? The uh, Oh Mickey Rourke. York. Mickey Rourke. Mickey Rourke. Him without makeup, he looks terrible on camera. I know. <laughs> he like age does not help these people out. But did and, he look dope in that movie? Yeah, he did. He, he looked did. he looked crazy. I yeah. Was like, oh, yeah. I, yeah. <laughs> so uh Ray Liotta's in it and all of every other Adam Sandler cast member That's you can always think of in it. Always yeah. in the um Maya Rudolph is in it. And she plays a really funny part, but it's a funny movie. It's a really funny movie. They put more of his family members in there. Yeah, his daughters are both in it. Mm-hmm. And like, I was looking at the looks just like it. I was looking at all the cast. Looks just like Adam Sandler. I was like, I, was like oh, I hope they're not gonna be as bad as his wife was in freaking. No, they they did really good. Was it was like they had really like cute innocent parts, and it was oh, the wrong movie. Missy where his wife was in it. She was, she was cringy, man. Can I we forget that her. movie? Can we pretend that movie never happened? I would I rather. Thought it was good. Oh my gosh, that was such a terrible movie. That, there was it, good that wasn't parts. the worst thing. You we laughed at a lot of the parts, Stephen. <laughs> the only yeah. part I laughed at was when she like slides underneath of the. <laughs> 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 I know. I can imagine that happening to me. I mean, I, oh, <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, happened. that movie had yeah, some yeah. some funny parts. It had more funny parts. Yeah. But it's just overall, it wasn't. It just wasn't a good movie. Yeah. Yeah. I disagree. So speaking I of good, okay. not movies, <laughs> but I've been playing a I've been playing a good game lately. Not not a Plague Tale. I bought yeah. the uh, Mario 3D, uh, the uh, All Stars, for the Switch. Dude, I've been playing the crap out of those games. I started out with Mario 64 because I was like, oh, this game is awesome and it's nostalgic, and I forgot that. That game's camera sucks. It makes it miserable to have to like move around corners and high stuff. So I, I moved over to Mario Sunshine. I love that game. It's so much fun. It's just such a happy game. I'm not familiar with Mario like, Sunshine. Really? Yeah. Man, you just got to look up some stuff for Mario Sunshine. It's just a fun Mario game. Okay. And uh, I think it's the first game where they introduce, uh, well, <laughs> it's a spoiler alert. <laughs> but for like a 10 year old 20 year old game yeah 2002 i think is when it came out so 18 years old uh that i think they introduced baby bowser in this one. Oh, really yeah baby and he bowser. he plays he like disguises himself as a shadow mario and then it comes out later that it's him and he thinks that peach is his mom that's what bowser tells baby bowser and so baby bowser frames mario and you got to undo all the work that Baby Bowser did. Mm. But it's really good. It's a fun game. It's a really good game. I've played it for like two days and I'm like way into it now. I'm not halfway, but way into it. Right, right, crap. right. So way into it. So you guys, you guys should get on it. I know you got a Switch, Mick. Yeah, I do got a Switch. Buy it. I've just been playing all the free to play games lately. Are those any good? I know like. I know, like, Xbox and PlayStation games are usually good free-to-play games. Like, I, uh, I've been playing, like, Smite. Ooh. It's like Smite a League of, Le- a League of Legends playoff, yeah. but it's, like, third person Smite. instead of over the top. Uh. I, like, I usually play that. And then they just came out with, uh, you know, Tetris 99? Yeah. Well, they came out with a version of that for Mario. And basically, you go through the stages and and, like compete with other people tetris 99 really pissed me off why <laughs> so i my mom got a switch 
And right. uh, I was over helping her out and she saw Tetris and I was like, oh, dang. And she's like, dad loves Tetris. And so I was going to download it. It is such a money grab Tetris game. Uh oh. It's so bad. You download the game, but you can only play the online online matchmaking. Yeah. You and have you to buy, buy yeah. the rest of the game to play local single player. You're thinking and local vice, you think yeah, it'd be vice. the other way around. Yeah. But it's so it's like I don't I'm never ever ever gonna buy Tetris to play online multiplayer. I'm gonna play it to have fun and like play with my wife and you know go through the single player right. and, and they understood they understood that so yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah like, exactly how they about they you download good. this it's good online. business it's good business yeah, it is good there's business. a pinhole thing. game that was like that a while back too remember i the- still like the night i it's a, still a good idea i have fun i ha- still haven't got first on that. i'm surprised i've gotten second on on that but that's that's first. still pretty good that's pretty <laughs> Yeah, that's saying a lot. Look at you. Yeah, I can be number one on Tetris. I just like to (laughs) bail every once in a while. Yeah, ring it, pat yourself on the back. Ring it, ring it. Yep. No, that's cool. uh, Yeah, I, I, uh, what other for you to play games are there on there? I, I, every uh, time I look, they're always like weird, like, uh, are they getting older and older? No, they're not older, they're just like wonky. Fortnite, they got DC Online. DC Online is a good one to get into. You get to create your own DC superhero, right? Yeah, and I played that a while back when it came yeah. out. I was kind of, I mean, it was, it was, I guess it was fun for a while, but it's like it, it wasn't yeah, like, kind of cheesy. They had this big, all- like, giant, like, opening scene, like, the, or just like this, that big teaser for you. You guys remember that? That big, yeah, rendered fight that they had with them got people all juiced up and hyped up for it. And then, yeah, that was awesome. Though. That, that's that's still like the an, an unbeatable moment. Yeah, yeah. I, it, I haven't seen anything else yet that can top that. For being a free game and being a uh, MMO, it's it's okay. I enjoy it. I enjoy it because it's free. Yeah. So. I thought initially that you're gonna be able to be a superhero in that one though. Yeah, you can be technically you are, you create your one, but I make your own superhero. superhero. I've never played it. No, you are a superhero in that one. No, you create your superhero and you work with the superhero that you're you want. Oh, you wanted to be the actual like Superman and all that stuff. No, yeah, you create your own character and you work for the superhero superhero that you run your missions and stuff. Yeah. I get you. gonna make I wanna see a big fighting game that is Marvel versus dc versus mortal kombat versus street fighter <laughs> whoa put them all in there look at the licensing wow. on that <laughs> yeah put i know them, put them all in there <laughs> and i, I want to see that a thing marvel would sell versus, like crazy i want to see marvel and and uh mortal kombat i definitely want to see that not have, dc and have they done dc and mortal kombat yeah, yeah. and just oh yeah Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, yeah. Injustice oh, yeah, it was is just, just DC. No, what was it called? They did a Mortal Kombat in DC though. Right. Yeah, I, I, I think it was just. I forgot what they called it, but yeah, they do. They do have that. That they have Mortal okay. Kombat in DC. Because I remember Scorpion fighting the Joker, and Superman, stuff. and stuff like that. So. Yeah, Superman and the Joker. Um. Yeah, I never played. There's some Mortal Kombat news. I saw they're releasing some combat something too. I don't know who was in it. I didn't look into it at all. Yeah, it's uh, the, the the newest one I just released has Rain, Melina, and uh, Rambo. And then okay. combat pack. Rambo. Rambo. Yeah. All right. Do you know any of those people? Are you guys familiar with Mortal Kombat? Oh, I'm familiar with them. I don't know. Uh, no, who's don't. Rambo? Rambo's not a more common character. He's just he's Rambo. Down Sylvester low, Stallone. Yeah. Is it like yeah. Sylvester Stallone's yeah. Rambo? Yeah. Go and go get that guy tonight. That's another guy who yeah. isn't aging yeah. well. <laughs> yeah. He, who's not? He's not aging well. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Aging. His plastic surgery is just showing. Yeah, yeah. He should just, he just should have aged gracefully. He's still yoked. He should, yeah. He should have aged gracefully. What's wrong with you? Yeah. Yeah. No. Um... That's Did cool. you know his story, man? That's crazy. Yeah, that is Sloan. crazy. He was a yeah. bum. 
Yeah, and they wrote Didn't a story, have, and yeah. they was like, I want to be the actor no matter what. And they were like, hey, we'll buy it, but we don't want you to do it. And right. Like, hmm. And then you can't have it. Yeah. He actually sold his dog to somebody, right? Okay. Is that how it went? To get money? So to get money, could, yeah. Yeah, to, for something. And then he ended up buying his dog back for a whole bunch more, but he ended up getting his wow. dog back. But he was a bum on the street, and they didn't want him. And he was like, then you get him my script. And somehow, some way, they wanted the script that bad. And so they let him be the Rocky. Rocky that's for Rocky, right? The first, yeah. That was his first movie with yep. Rocky. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Coming from rags to riches. That's, yeah, no that's pretty ballsy, dude. Most people, if you're if you're a bum and you, you're poor and you're struggling, like yeah. someone gives you any money for it, you're like, oh, yeah, okay, I'll take it. Yeah. yeah. But like to have the, be, the able to yeah. be like, no, I want it the way I want it and take it or leave it. That's. I More know. Power to him, man. <laughs> when they could have just said, uh, "Yeah, right. yeah, okay, okay. No problem. whatever." Yeah. Stinky, right. enjoy <laughs> the street. <laughs> enjoy right. where you're at. <laughs> yeah, man, that is crazy. That's that's cool. I yeah. Talk uh, about a success story. Yeah, okay. no right. kidding. No that's kidding. crazy. Rambo, all the stuff that he's done. He's I've actually never seen. Now, I've never seen that. a Rambo movie. You never seen a Rambo what? movie? I need to see like the original. You gotta see him. The originals are better. Yeah, I know. Like yeah. what they're they more like, believable. Rambo Seven now, where he just like yeah. runs with a machete and Rambo chops everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Running yeah. super slow motion. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I wish I could get in shape like that. Oh, speaking of getting in shape like that. Oh, what? I wanna. I wanna. It's the- yeah that's right that's gonna be me i'm gonna i'm gonna gonna say it to you guys here on this podcast oh i'm gonna say it to you guys listening on the airwaves he's Um, lying to you i'm gonna i'm gonna commit to a 30-day body transformation uh workout i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna work out and work my butt off and hopefully I make it. <laughs> Wait, okay. So what's your goal? Like you're not overweight by any stretch. No, of I wanna, so like, I wanna get in shape. I wanna get some some muscular definition. Some muscles. I wanna, like I wanna, me. I wanna, I wanna <laughs> either just... look like Hugh Jackman, the Wolverine. Can you do this, Jason? Or I wanna be like look like Steve Rogers, <laughs> Captain America. Whoa. Steve Rogers. Yeah, I wanna I wanna be able to hold back in a helicopter from taking off. Yeah, like did, right, man. dude. You... <laughs> <laughs> well, dude, that's awesome. you, I support that's you. Can yeah. I can I join you? You can join, man. Come on. What do we win? Uh, well, yeah, that's the thing. So I was thinking <laughs> of like consequences, right? So like what's what's the consequence if I don't? So this is a commitment, a guarantee that I'm saying. So if I don't follow through, then what is my consequence so i don't know i was i don't know what do you maybe you guys can help me out with that okay i gotta smack you in the face okay so <laughs> yeah okay okay it's my so foot that's <laughs> <laughs> my <foot. laughs> i was thinking the same thing like what's gonna motivate me i like uh, how you guys want to hurt me and <laughs> no, no, no. Me. no hey i said i would join you i like i okay i'll put it right here right now I am going to, I will join Jay if he allows me. I don't want to like jump into your little thing you're doing, but I've been wanting to get in shape. I need a reason to get in shape. Okay, and, well, come on. Let's and do the this. fear of pain is a reason for me to get in shape. <laughs> okay. But I was thinking something like a little more extreme. Like, what if we got like shot with a paintball gun? Oh my God. <laughs> I'll do that. That don't hurt. Right. Oh my God. Right. Or like tased. Anybody have a taser? No. Or pepper sprayed. Don't got a paintball gun either. Or pepper sprayed. <laughs> pepper sprayed. What you are know I doing? <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Like those are real, those are real consequences. Oh, We're not, oh, I don't man. want to get slapped in the face. I want like a real consequence. All right. Oh, like man. what other what other consequence would there be? I'll fart in your face. No, please. come on. That's not a <laughs> well, <laughs> well, that's just disgusting. That's I guess a, that's a normal too. thing. <laughs> That's not a consequence. <laughs> that, I, I like your thing. farts, <laughs> man. <laughs> <sighs> that's gross. That makes me want to throw up right now. Just thinking about it. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh, <laughs> I you know you like it. it. Smells like blueberries. 
Well, Nothing. I was thinking. I was thinking originally that it might be something to uh, get the get the listeners and the and the viewers involved. Like if they um, say whether or not I make it or not, or if I don't, like how far along would I have gotten? And the person who gets it posts <clears throat> it something, like gives somebody some money or something. So are we know. doing weight or? what what's the stipulation See, but that's the thing you know? it can't be he can't do weight yeah like i can do weight and there's no way i'm gonna weight, get but, defined but in 30 it. days <laughs> what I'm there's not, what there's no way i can what? i said i can do weight but gaining it yeah what did you say though Mick? I gaining is easy i'll win that in a second <laughs> yeah let's <laughs> gain weight i, I, I love I'll eat a carrot and gain like five pounds um okay so I have but, like a I have like a goal weight in mind that I want to get down to. Okay. So like I want to lose 20 pounds. But 20 pounds might be a lot for 30 days. It might be. That's a lot of weight to lose yeah. in 30 days. What's the average like two pounds a week is like a good healthy weight loss? Yeah. So 10 pounds. You gotta say that it's not possible. But I mean, yeah, that's a lot of weight. I mean, I could days. lose weight. That's a just, lot of weight for 30 days. What do I really want to do? So 15 pounds. Let's say I lose 15 pounds. Okay. Because I feel like 10 is like, I could do 10 pounds. But 15. If I don't, this is what I was thinking, especially with like paintballs. Okay. Because I hate the feeling of like paintballs. Okay. Um, if if for every, every pound that I don't, that I miss, right? For every pound, like the difference between what I am and what I right. want to be. What you want it, yeah. Is worth Every pound is worth two paintballs. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I think you want to just get shot with a paintball. I know. No, no, no. It seems like, like, doesn't it? No, I don't. I don't. I'm just saying, like, I'm, I'm so afraid of it that I would do that. I, it would make funny content. We got to record it, whatever we do, getting hurt with, right? right? We got to record that. Right. And go, we'll go live on Facebook. And could you imagine, like... <laughs> Man, this is what steven's hurt. gonna get shot with if he it's doesn't make his me. weight uh well i'm down because i'm already in the process of losing weight i'm already 40 pounds down Ooh, look oh look at you wow man look at you look at you go yes sir i'm under 300 finally so, so that means we're all all three of us then we're all getting in on this yeah i'm, I'm down yeah. how about we lose uh let's lose Steven, well, we're I'm gonna just, lose weight. I'm right? yeah, no, I'm looking I'm just to make sure it. I stick with the program and stay committed. That was my initial thing. Like, make sure I do the 30 days. Oh, okay. So, uh, well, I just looked up something. So, over the long term, it's smart to aim for losing one to two pounds a week. All right, that's what we say. So, so we would be 10 if pounds. 15, if we did 15 pounds, that'd be like three that'd pounds. Be almost, that'd be almost double that. We got to lose 10 pounds, and then Jason got to gain 10 pounds in muscle, no fat. Gain 10 pounds? That's a lot to gain. <laughs> That's a lot. <laughs> 10 pounds it's of fair. muscle? It's fair. You got to just wow. do it. You got to do like a dirty bulk, Jason. You just got to start no. eating like a pig. No. Yeah, yeah, you do. You really, you actually do. No. You need to start upping your carb. No. What do you I'm mean no? Dirty. I'm not going to do it like that. What do you, how are you going to do I'm it? Gonna, I'm not, I'm going to do it the right way. That is, I'm not saying That's a, a not, dirty bulk is bad. I'm not saying that, but you do need to up your intake, your food intake. I, I, to, I understand this. I understand what you're saying. You just got to be stuffed every meal. No, no. You stuff yourself. He's, he's not, good. he's not bodybuilding. Listen to me. If there's one thing I know, it's how to gain weight. Okay. <laughs> okay. <but laughs> listen, we're not gaining weight the way the you pro, gain okay? weight. Though. We're gaining, <laughs> we're trying to. He's kind of trying to stay lean and All just right. keep. All right. Lots that of that means meat chicken meat breasts, potatoes. a little bit of white rice and vegetables, eating like four or five meals a day. God, that's what I'm mm-hmm. going to have to do. And that sounds so terrible. What? Eating four or five meals a day? No, 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 no. Just like the, the rice vegetables. and chicken and vegetables. That's what you I eat right now. Problem. Problem. No rice, though. I'm on a low carb you're diet. Weirdo? You're on a low carb diet? Yeah. I need to do low carb too. I, to do every, I think I eat all carbs. And I stopped drinking. So 
Sorry, man. That that's a lot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <That's> yeah <laughs> dick. <laughs> I'm gonna do that what? too. <laughs> I'm gonna do that. Too. What 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 are, what are we stopping? <laughs> nah. Uh, <clears throat> yeah. Right. So are you guys are you guys chronicling your uh your your days or what? Yeah, what I will. Doing? I will. So you're gonna so have we're... thirty days logged. Yeah. Are we doing exactly thirty days or like a count like a calendar? Like 30, 30 days, days from today. Steven is asking, can we start next month? <laughs> <'Cause> <laughs> <I> wanna... <laughs> Are we talking Shut about up, this Mick. month or next month? <laughs> <laughs> no, I meant like, are we starting Monday? Like is Monday our start? Monday. Day? Yeah. So, oh, so when this episode is airing, so Monday, we're weighing in. Yeah. Monday morning. Yep. And we're going at it. Yep. yep. And if you want, I'll even, well... I don't know about you, Mick, because I know you know how to work out and stuff already. But um, so I got a little workout regimen already that I'm gonna that I've been kind of putting together for my. And I was gonna, if you want me to send that your way, Stephen. Yes, please. So they kind of have a basis to what you feel is right for you. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. Don't I'm just don't even tell me if it's right for me. Just do it. I want to work out until I puke. Like that's how <laughs> I am. <laughs> well, that's only up to you though. That's whether you push yourself far. Yeah, no, hundred percent. I'm all in. <laughs> but i might have to alter a little bit because you said you don't really have like weights for anything right i don't have like weight weights yeah i don't have weights but i can go run and do push-ups i got enough weight on my body that if i did a push-up i would be like lifting a cow so that's how it feels when i do a push-up <laughs> my goal my goal is to like when i get off the couch not go <laughs> to get out of the, to get, right, to get right. out of my seat Okay. Or to not have to hold my breath to tie my shoe oh, I know. every morning. That's the struggle. <laughs> you know, I don't have to do that anymore. You don't? No. Oh. And my wife says, uh, you today, slip on? today my wife was all like, <laughs> you <get> slip on? <laughs> what is going on here? You don't got chicken legs. Because I think it might be because you lost some of your face or it might be the shoes, but <laughs> it don't look like you're you don't look like a popsicle anymore. <laughs> what a great description. I was like, well, thank you. <laughs> Thanks, babe. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> look like man. a pickle now. <laughs> <laughs> All even now. Um, well, hey, I'm down. What, what should we, we should, uh, all right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to give, all right. I just like took this thing over and I didn't mean to. <laughs> no, go ahead. <laughs> Uh, jason's i know it's a totally jason's yeah. i feel like a jerk what if we just put it out on the facebook page and say like hey we're gonna weigh in we'll put our pictures up on the page on on monday right mm -hmm. of our scales i'll do it put them up there and then uh we let the audience decide we give them like two weeks to to decide what they want us to do as a punishment oh, okay and put it up to them all right you know i like it I like it. Let's try it. Let's that's, do that. that <laughs> I'm oh, getting heart palpitations like, because of like, Swallow 409. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> People are going to take some crazy stuff. Swallow 409. We'll take, a, we'll take the less ridiculous one that... Yeah, that yeah. Try to, be, try to be... Like, okay, so what are we going to do if it's stab yourself in the neck? Swallow 409. What do you think our, fa do you think our fans hate us? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Then we we You're gonna most of our fans crap most of our fans most of our fans know us yeah that's true so they're that's gonna true make too. it worse <laughs> that's very true all my um, family's gonna be the same thing I said what? let me slap you in the face with my foot dude I don't want to get knocked out have you ever seen those slap competitions yeah those yeah. are it's crazy it's intense me man. and my brother and my cousin used to do that all the time I'll need like before it was I'll a need bang. like four of these before I can do a slap competition yeah you definitely need some of those help with the okay so we're gonna put it up to you guys on oh, what we geez. should do well i'm just gonna lose 10 pounds so i don't gotta worry yeah I'm, yeah i'm just gonna hit my goal i'll lose double so i don't have to do anything <laughs> there we go <laughs> <laughs> All so, right. so make your 10 steven you're doing 15 still or what um i should probably shoot for 10 something realistic right yeah okay so 10 is a good one 
10 to good. So if we start Monday, that's October 12th. 14, 21. Wait, so should I put a wait then? You guys are doing weights. That, that, would, be, that would be November 11th would be our, our cutoff day. You know what you should days. do, Jason? What? You should take a, pi a, a picture of yourself, uh -huh. right? Yeah. All right. And then we'll we'll take those two pictures before and after me and Steve will do a critique. Okay. Right. All right. Can you just do a, a bodybuilding competition on the? We'll just we'll you just your wife can grease you up and you can do your <laughs> yeah <laughs> Wolverine pose on stream and. <laughs> Of course, Steven wants Don't you to do grease Don't up. Do that. <laughs> Why do you got to go that way all the time? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Don't make it weird. <laughs> You're making it weird. I said his wife could grease him up. I didn't say... <laughs> I didn't say we would. <laughs> no, you say you would. All right. No, we, have, we. we have proof. I said his wife could grease up. And then he'll just do his little bodybuilding competition here. And then we'll judge him. And we'll hold up scorecards. Like, you get it? You get it? Yeah. All right, I'm out of ideas. I give up. You guys suck. You guys, you guys are terrible. Shut up. Just shut up. I hate you guys. <laughs> no, I mean, I guess that would be the only way to, like, um, I think I, I honestly think that's that what works. we should do. I mean, we should yeah, do all, all of us should do the same thing. We should take a picture of us and a picture of our scale. Oh, yeah. Starting Monday, and then oh, you want to see these boobs untamed? <laughs> you can put Man. your you can put your man's ear on, and I have no problem. I I get naked. Let's it's do this, bro. Man's ear, bro. bros, a bros ear, a bro, <laughs> yeah. a bro, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let's do this i have no problem i yeah i'm self-conscious and everything so whatever <laughs> yeah, I, know. I have insecurities but okay well, i do, do yeah it. sure we'll make it let's happen. put them out there for everyone's sake <laughs> the only reason why i wear clothes is because i gotta do this podcast as soon as the podcast is over i'm <laughs> off I'm underwear <laughs> the, underwear the, the out of the times i've called mick like alpha podcast the amount of times he's had his shirt off far outweighs the amount of times he's had his shirt on <laughs> he's, just like, he's just like what's up dude i'm like why do you got your shirt off what are you doing he's like ah whatever it's my, it's my house i'll walk around whatever I want to. wow my wife when she has her friends over my wife's all like you please put on a shirt why i gotta wear my house <laughs> there is my house. Out of my house. Yeah, you, get to my house. you get whatever happened. <laughs> Whatever's going on. You better here, warn you them before it. they come, then. Yes. What the hell? What's going on? Yeah. <laughs> you, you get a sign that says like free the nipple. <laughs> free the nipple. <laughs> In my house. <laughs> when you come into this house, be aware there's no shirts allowed. Well, no just no for shirts. just for me. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you keep your shirt on. Just <laughs> cool. Okay. I'm in. All right, let's do it, guys. Let's do it. 30 it is days. now set in stone because it's on a recording. People about, are going to see about it. 30 for 30. 30 days for 30 pounds. No, dude. What are you... <laughs> that is impossible. It is impossible. I mean, I'm trying impossible. to starve myself. Yeah. I know. I'm already starving eating rabbit food that I am right now. <laughs> I know. Oh, man. I got I to gotta have, like, my last meal on Sunday. Eat a big old steak your last, or something. Your last meal. Oh yeah, you gotta splurge and make it splurge. make it good. I'm having pizza on Sunday or something. <laughs> yeah, you better make it better than pizza. Pizza's amazing. Something. I could eat pizza every day for the rest of my life and be a happy man. I never get tired what? of pizza. Really? I never get tired of pizza. Me neither. I'll, I love I'll pizza. say I'll be like, I'll be like, babe, what do you want to do for dinner? And she's like, I don't know. I want to do pizza. She's like, we literally had pizza last night. I'm like, so what? <laughs> <laughs> no. pizza, try pizza. it. Try it. I want to see you do pizza. it. We need to. I want. No, do you want me to lose this. weight or do you want me to die? No, I know we need to postpone this thirty to... days thing. I want to see how long you go about eating pizza without eating pizza. With eating pizza, it would With be just every, pizza. Day. Every, every day. Every day. I had breakfast, pizza today. lunch, and dinner. Pizza. Same breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I make breakfast. Yeah. They make breakfast pizzas. Yeah, yeah. breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Pizza. A taco is basically a breakfast pizza. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I can't give her. <laughs> 
<laughs> uh, tacos just <laughs> basically <laughs> breakfast pizza. Did you really just say that? <laughs> oh my that god. Made no no <laughs> sense. <at> wow. <laughs> he said a ta- a taco is basically <laughs> a breakfast. <laughs> No, you didn't. No, you didn't. I have no idea what I just <laughs> said. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, I'm my, say God. That my gosh. That was like, Ty goes the winner. <laughs> oh, my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> a taco is basically a breakfast pizza. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Wow. I'm stupid every time I say it. <laughs> That's one of you, <laughs> that's one of the worst ones I've ever done. Oh my gosh. 100% Steven. 100%. 100%. Yeah, whatever. Go just... all the way in, man. <laughs> go all the way in. That needs to go on a shirt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, no, no, it's just a bit of pizza. <laughs> How can I say something so stupid? (laughs) Oh man! (laughs) Oh wow, that that was a good one. That was a good one. I'm stuck. I can't. I can't move on. Say something. Take it to a new topic. (laughs) Say something next. Yeah, what's next? It's hard to it's hard to double back on that one. Oh my gosh! (laughs) Oh my goodness! Oh no, but I'm I'm down with that whole ordeal. Oh, get down. Just do it. Get up to get down. I'm about to lose that 10 pounds heck a quick, yo. Let's do it. It's gonna be tougher for you, Mick, because you already lost some. So you're gonna at some oh, point. I got plenty, bro. Out. I got, got plenty. Yeah, but there's that plateau mark, you know. Look at this thing. Plenty. Oh my gosh. That's about t- sit down. Right there. Plenty, dude. I'm tired of this oh, nonsense. Man. Once upon a time. I look good. Yeah, we all did. I, did I was too. buff and yoked and did the Highland Games and all that stuff. I have a picture that oh. I want. I want my body to look like again when I was in like high school. I know I can't go back to high school, but that's what I want. Man, I'm <laughs> yeah, I'm a wreck right now. I look, I look, I look like that. What's the doctor scale? What is that called? The BMI B, BMI scale. Body uh, they say yes. I'm supposed to be at 185. Oh no way! No, man. No last way. time I was last time I was 185. You're like a freshman. I was in, in seventh grade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I think I'm supposed to be like 170 on the BMI. I would look like skin and bones if I was 170. Yeah, 260, 260, 260, 265. I look healthy. And I just got that nice thin layer where I'm not, you know, you can feel you can feel the abs, but it doesn't show. You know what I mean? I'm still thick, and I still I look healthy. You know what I mean? Right, 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 right. The way I like to look. My also, my goal weight is two fifteen. That's where I want to be at. Like hard set two fifteen. Honestly, I don't I don't I don't care how I look. <clears throat> honestly, I it's I just want to feel better. Feel, you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, so I want to be more better. healthy. Yeah. I don't mind the good. I've had. I don't. It all comes long. with it, man. You yeah. feel better. You you do this stuff. You feel better. You look better. You know what I mean? Yeah. They all come together. Yeah. yeah. I just got a giant head, so I can't lose too much weight. <laughs> Your head. I already look anybody. like a pop school. I ain't trying to look <laughs> like a a, a lollipop. <laughs> a lollipop. <laughs> yeah, my whole body's a stick, and the head awesome. is. Yeah. Hey, I saw something. Normal. I saw something that's a little bit of a change of subject. What is um, it? AMC theaters is clo- or Regal theaters are closing down. Yeah, the Regal and the Thomas one I know it's closing for sure. Yeah, they oh, should close down. Yeah. Um, is it Regal oh, or man. AMC? Regal is what Regal. I heard. Yeah, it's yeah. Regal. Regal movie chain will close all 536 U.S. theaters. Dang man, oh, yeah. Thursday the freaking COVID. Thanks, COVID. Yeah, man, I got gift cards with Regal. <laughs> I got sucks. gift. Oh, I've yeah, I think Cinemark. I got some too. I've got a Cinemark gift card. 
right before this mm-hmm. thing dropped. I think I got it for Christmas. Yeah. Never used it. It sucks, man. Forty thousand. I wonder if I wonder if like once all this stuff is over, like if you can like buy that theater, if you if it'll be lucrative for you to <sighs> do, that'd be crazy. Go into it. You think you think it'll be worth it? Yeah, but you know how many connections you would have to have to get those movies to play in your theater. But you would get them eventually over time, and then you won't have them right away. But right, eventually they'll come. You know what's going to happen because all the luxury theaters are in store. Another up and coming person with some capital will yep. turn yeah. into yeah. something like Studio Movie Grill. Yeah, you know right. I mean? Like a luxury theater where you could eat and all that stuff. I want work. Studio Movie Grill, but not luxury. I just want it like what. Applebee's, you know what I mean? Like, I want that kind of atmosphere. I don't want it to be like, like I got tables. Do I don't want to like have to dress up super nice to go to watch a movie and eat food. You don't have to. I don't. Yeah. I don't no, but have nice. you ever been there? It's all like there's like a bar and all the mood lighting. Like, just like I don't know. I don't care about. I think it. You're overthinking it, man. I just still yeah, go. I like go in there so flip flops and tank top. <laughs> yeah. And some, no, I some, know you can. I'm going comfortable. Boxer I'm shorts. <laughs> I mean, uh, boxer uh, shorts. I don't, uh, that's what, don't, shorts. don't try to. You would go in your boxer shorts. Get out of here. <laughs> I don't care. Wait, this isn't the Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's definitely a Walmart dress Man, code. Basketball Walmart. shorts. Um. Yeah. No. I. Uh. I. I like. I like that idea. I want. Um. I like Studio Movie Girl. I want more of them. That's. I guess that's what I'm saying. I want more. Yeah. Of them. That's where all these other movie theaters are moving and doing, yeah. at least here in Sacramento. Yeah. It's smart, too. Yeah. It's the quality of the experience. That's what you're paying for, honestly. The yeah. quality, not, you know. You know what I really want? I want another what? drive-in theater. Why? I mean, drive-ins are, I don't know, man, because, like, certain movies I wouldn't see at a drive-in. Like, like darker like, pictures? Like, summer summer movie blockbusters, I would never go see a summer movie. Mm in a drive-in That's it's true. just it's, it's not the kind of atmosphere we can focus in and get into and have that experience of what <clears> we're doing. <throat> it's certain things like if you have your kids if it's a kid movie or something like that or if it's like yeah. a family film or you know something like that then to it eat works it's own i yeah, like it. i like them all it's, right. too. it's all yeah i like um i just don't like seeing like dark movies yeah like I, harry the potter last one I saw, and all that i saw stuff the, the like, new mutants it's hard to see yeah, it was. It's like the blacks are not true black. Right. The, can I just say something? Can I have a little PSA? Look at me. Look right here. Look at me. If you go to a drive-in movie theater and the movie is started and you drive through with your freaking lights on, I'm going to slash your tires. <laughs> <laughs> it is the worst thing in the world to be watching a movie and have some doofus driving up with their brights on ruining the movie for everybody else and just like slowly taking the weaving through looking for a space well don't now do it. well then the nowadays, lights are off they can't find the space i don't that's your problem that's your <laughs> fault you should have been on the movie on you time can't see man if you ain't got everybody knows drive ins are at night time, down, get to the movie 30 minutes early that's a, well, a lot of times i with your lights off at night. a lot of times put your running lights cars. on i don't care about your running lights a don't lot of them your... are still bright though. Yeah, they're not bright enough. But like, like I feel light. so bad for it because I I just got a Jeep. Yeah, and my running lights are they're pretty, <laughs> they're still bright. So when I when I was but pulling they're not into like them, your they're not like your headlights. Yeah, but it still projects its light onto the screen, and it kind of it uh, just yeah. with these newer cars, some of them you can't the lights are going to be bright no matter what. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know older cars. You could turn that thing off and nothing happened. But the I just newer want, cars are just built that way. I, but I, I get, get it. I totally get it. I I'm get like, another, turn off your lights. If I ever get another job, <laughs> my job is going to be as a, uh, oh, I'm going to work at the drive-in oh, movie theater and I'm going to walk <laughs> around. And if you take drive, if you drive with your headlights on, I'm going to take the skinny side of a fishing pole and I'm just going to whack you as you get out of the car, right in the back of your thigh. I'm just, and just oh that's God. what you get <laughs> turn your headlights off next time that would hurt that would hurt that's that should be crazy, a punishment man. for not losing weight <laughs> that's no no Let's use your fishing pole 
I have that a color. nice little switch. <laughs> go, pick, go pick your switch. <laughs> yeah, go pick a switch. <laughs> That's what I, people are going to make us do. <laughs> I go come back with a big old <laughs> log. Big log. <laughs> so you can't swing it. Yeah. There you oh, go. Oh, man. So hopefully, uh, hopefully theaters come back. I'm, yeah. I want, I want theaters back. Yeah, but we need to do that thing that Cinemark was was doing, dude. That that Let's auditorium rental thing, man. For twenty people, we need to get on that. Let's do it. Yeah. Make it happen. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Share with everybody. Watch some movies. Huh? He said, "Share with everyone." Yeah, share what it is. Oh, so Cinemark's doing this thing for uh, depending on what day you go, what movie you're watching. But if you're watching a new movie over the weekend, it's like one hundred and forty nine dollars. You can have the whole auditorium to yourself to watch a movie. Uh, with you and 20 people, well, you, well, 20 people all together, including you. Yeah. And so, but depending, they got new movies on there, and then they also got like some older classic movies. So they got like things like Nightmare Before Christmas or some other Halloween movies. I think they actually have Halloween there. Uh, they got some Christmas Story or Christmas Carol or something. Um, and then those ones are cheaper. So those ones are like $99 or something like that. Um, but, uh, also, I think it's cheaper during the week. So if you go a weekday, which is probably matinee, I'm not sure, but it says if you go a weekday that it could be as low as fifty dollars. So, but I don't know if that's the same as weeknight. So, but I don't know. But it'll be worth checking out, man, to see pinpoint a good time, a good price, and uh, be able to pick out a good movie to watch. And then, then you don't have to worry about strangers, you know, in your vicinity. Yeah. Uh, being careful because you can take. Just the people that you want, uh, that you're close well, you, to already. You said a cool thing too, because I was like, "Oh, I'd have to get sitters," and then you're like, "Well, you can bring yeah. your kids because it's your yeah, movie theater. You don't yeah, have to worry about Yeah, it's our theater. I mean, it's just us. Them. So yeah, yeah. We, just, we can all bring our families, and I think sweet. it'd be a pretty cool thing to do. It'd be really fun. Yeah, to I think that would be I'm awesome. Look into it. Yeah, I'm looking into it. I, cause I really want to see Tenant. To be honest, I know with you. I, I would like I to see Tenant. But we could go. Like we could just go see Tenant. It's in theaters. Yeah. Up, up the hill. Up the hill. Oh. And yeah. uh yeah. El Dorado County. Yeah, but it's just weird. It's it's harder for me to just get out and do it that way. So that's why this auditorium thing makes yeah. sense because then I can if I don't have a you way can to control break away, the I environment can... there too. Yeah, you know what I mean? Exactly. Like with yeah. everything going on, you can just mm-hmm. like these are the people I want. I know they're all good. Let's go yeah. have some fun. Right. That'd be fun. I think it's a good idea that they're doing that. So I don't know. Yeah, I like it. It's a really smart idea. I'm down to do it. Well, cool. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What else we got? Um, else not much more. You know, oh, I, I, Wonder Woman. You know, this is always. I feel like every episode we talk about the same things. Another we movie's do. getting delayed. Another movie's going to There's stream. just it's because of COVID. Like if I'm telling you, if this wasn't a COVID year, we would be progressing so much farther in like yeah. what we've been talking about, what we've been doing. But it's all right. Because I think I heard Wonder Woman. They might be doing a simultaneous theater PVOD video on demand thingy. I like that for her. I don't, but I know you don't. I'm just, I'm just at the point where I, I want to see it. Just give me the movie it. already. Yeah, I don't care how I need to watch it. Just let <laughs> so, me watch it. Yeah, I'm at that point. Yep. I just want to watch it. Yeah, so I don't. I, I, it sucks for them though because I think that's gonna take away. Uh, if they don't put it on streaming platforms, I think it might help. If it's just on demand, video on demand, I think it might help because it doesn't have the as much share capability as like yeah, you know, as it does for streaming. That's true, but um, what they could do, what they could do for streaming, they could link it to an IP address. Yeah, like when you get it, you have to buy it. Like if this IP address has already rented this movie, you cannot. But you know that that's there are. I'm sure they're already working on that because once they figure that out, yeah, you're not going to be able to share. Yeah, exactly. You're not going to be able to roam accounts. Exactly, because so, like I'm, just because you're sharing an account, yeah, just because you're sharing an account, it, mm. it's a, to a million different IP addresses, so you have to have individual, yeah, IP. But it makes sense; they're gonna do it. It's something like that is gonna happen. It, mm-hmm. it's got oh yeah, they're gonna, yeah, they're it. gonna figure it out. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna do it at some point. They may, they may not. Are you picking your nose, Nick? 
No, I was messing with my nose ring. Oh, <laughs> I always forget you have a nose ring. Yeah. Um, they may may not. The only reason I say that because now with these streaming services, they're cutting out the middleman, like HBO and all that stuff. You can mm-hmm. just get HBO now. You don't have to get cable, cable. anymore. Right. right. So they're the money's coming straight to them. So they're actually making more money now than they were going through the cable company. I would love to see a graph on how many people have cut cable. Cause like I'm part of that. I have, I don't have cable anymore. Yeah. Cable is going to be non-existent here. And yeah. Network. Just internet. Yep. It's just going to be all internet. Yep. But it's weird. I think I mentioned this to you guys before and, but it's kind of weird, isn't it? Because it's like you cut cable because of the cost and then like you get every streaming service there is. And it's like, isn't it almost like a cable cable price? No, nah, because you're paying like three hundred bucks for yeah. cable. You know, like oh, you get through, you get deal, like all the premium channels deal. and stuff like that. You your, well, you could get you whatever get like you want. Cable you get, network. So, so basically, if I want to watch HBO stuff, I could get HBO app and just watch HBO stuff. I don't have to buy a package from a cable company that has Showtime, HBO, blah 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 shows I uh, channels I even watch. Yep. You know, I get a, a thousand channels, but I only watch like four of those channels, right? So, and then even even with Netflix, Hulu, uh, HBO, uh, Disney, mm-hmm. Amazon, still doesn't equate to some of the deals that they come out with, which is like a hundred dollars a month for six months, and then your price goes up to four hundred dollars. <laughs> A month yeah that's the, the cheapest that's package what, is like a hundred and something a hundred and something dollars and that's just the no that's cable. bundled packages if you're just talking cable internet service by itself it's like 50 60 bucks so that's what i'm talking about like i'm talking about cape standalone cable like if you're through not who? 50 60 bucks through who yeah that's that's basic not basic that's a uh, cable that's that's uh anybody pick you take your pick. I mean you're you're just your cable channels. If you're not getting like all the premium channels and stuff like that, cable network is like 50, 60 bucks, 65 bucks, I would probably say. Maybe through the inflation the last time For I seen sixty five bucks. Through a promotion. But that doesn't count that doesn't count your modem that you gotta buy, your box set that uh, you your box rent your first box month. is usually free anyway. Your your first box is included. That's if you get additional boxes. Oh. But your that's a still a promotion price. Yeah, that no, that, 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 that from, should be that the price regular price. That should be. I the don't reg- think that's the yeah. The promotional price. price would be something like twenty nine ninety nine or something like that, and then you get no, that for six no. months, and it bumps up. To what do you pay for? Yeah, what are you getting your? Yeah, where you, you got a black your... box? I, I worked over? at a cable company, guys. What? What? Yeah, you that's lie. where I worked Comca- before. Yeah, Comcast, I worked, right? Yeah, you, you churlish. Lying, insubordinate. Yeah, so I mean the prices. I have probably changed since I've left, but that's cable cable uh by itself. If you get a cable network programming, it I mean there's different there's different packages, of course, but there's different tiers and levels to it. But the 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 most common one that was that was received was a, I'm just gonna Average it around to sixty bucks. I'm gonna say sixty bucks. I think it was about sixty bucks then. I want to say it was actually even fifty something. But then, you know, prices go up every year, so uh, probably higher now, sixty, sixty-five bucks. But I was gonna, I would say around average sixty bucks. Okay. So if you take all these streamings, or they're typically ten bucks or higher, then you're gonna equate to that pretty much, and then you're gonna be able to get your local channels and stuff like that because you don't get local channels with your streaming anyway. Then you got to go and try to get Peacock and then. ABC app, NBC app, and try to get these things. Like, and then you still got to subscribe. A lot of these apps, like these local TV apps, that won't let you use them unless you put in unless your you cable subscriber your cable. anyway. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I can't do that a lot on a lot of my stuff. Yeah, so so that's what I'm saying. Because like, it's, it's, <sighs> if you're because a lot of people when they think cable bill, they think their their total bill because you're you have your internet too. That you got all these other stuff bundled into it, and they. Yeah talk you into a better price to get more channels or more faster internet so yeah that's when your bill starts to go up and then yeah and then you're paying for your modem but if you just get i'm talking just cable internet if you get cable internet you get a box for free and they give you this amount of channels 
and it's flat rate without a deal is I would say sixty bucks. Yeah. Oh, well. I agree with you. I my problem is like maybe seventy bucks now. I don't know. Yeah, I just feel like that that price only stays for a little bit. I had well, Comcast. I, I'm the promotional you, the promotion well you, like I said yeah I had it I bought it at that price I bought it at like seventy five dollars let's say I can't remember exactly what it was mm -hmm. within the two years two years goes by really fast when you're not thinking about a bill all right yeah right so after that two years I'm pretty sure it my bill doubled after that on top of all the connection problems I was having on top of all the there was times where I was like I was paying for two hundred gigs or two hundred megabytes download and whatever upload that is 25 megs upload and i was getting like 0.1 megs download and they were like oh yeah your modem blew out so they gave me a new modem and they're like oh well you're on the end of the pole so we need to butt the power uh more and it's blowing the signal out and like it's sorry it's just where you're at and i'm just like what am i paying for then like why am i paying all this so i called to pay i got the ring around this must be comcast because comcast just sucks um I got the ring around to like, I wanted to lower my plan. So I was like, well, let me pass you on to this one on hold. Let me pass you on this one. I was like, okay, I just want standard definition. To a person that base. don't even speak English. Yeah. <laughs> just hmm. give me the base, everything. Give me standard definition. And then I get my phone disconnected. And so I got to call up again and do it all. And it's just like, that's why I don't want, okay. I don't want to deal with the cable company. So like yeah, right now, yeah, I experience. My, I can get that. I have I my mean, internet. The convenience of uh, yeah, and streaming. It's like I streaming. Could pause I it, worry, come yep. back to it three days later, and then watch it again. I mean, you well, could pause it now. Yeah, you can, yeah, 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 yeah. on demand. You can do yeah. that. Yeah. yeah, you could do that on cable. I just don't. I don't know. Cut the cord. I, cut the. Cord. <laughs> I was just. My whole point was, most people are cutting it because of price, and then like they buy all these. <clears throat> subscriptions and it's like it's the same thing but it's so it's like are you did you really save any money because i'm not we've talked about it sharing everybody shares like i know it's like this like secret it's like this taboo secret everybody shares uh I don't a, know what about. you're a liar <laughs> everybody shares a streaming service with another person in their family it's guaranteed it happens i don't know what you're talking about and that's what i'm saying everybody's saving money when the price is shared Yep. Everybody's saving money. Yep. Because like I pay for I, I pay for a service that I pay the yearly price, so it's like seventy dollars for the year, and I let I can have up to five or six people share. Done. And I don't. You're even a bad person. It. I'm not a bad person. Yeah, you're a bad person. I'm a bad person. You're taking money out of people's business. <laughs> Out of the one business that has more money than any other business in the world know. right now, Comcast, all them people be lying. Yeah, they do. The, yeah. Obviously, is my bill is my bill going to change at all? Well, I don't know. This quite isn't now. a premium check. A... This is not a premium check pack pack. I just want internet, the basically internet. I don't want no premium. Pack. I want to just pay what it's going to pay. I'm going to pay for eight years of my internet connection service or whatever. I want. I don't want it to change. I want it to be the same. So if I got to pay 80 bucks, I'll pay 80 bucks or whatever it is. No, no, this is going to be the same the whole time. Next thing you know, three months down the road, I'm paying $96. I'm like, where is, what the heck? What? <laughs> you guys are, you guys, uh, Jason, you, guys are either, you work there, you know what it's I, I like. I know it happens, you know but it doesn't, if you get a flat truth. rate deal, it doesn't change that drastically. It does. The only time it changes it that drastically go, you know what they say? is when they you get a deal. If you get a, you know if you get a, a promotional well, they deal told me, promo right Because I spoke to some dude in India, told me that it wasn't going to change. Must have been a miscommunication. I said, I said, this isn't a package deal, right? This is what my bill is going to be forever. It's not going to change. Well, not, Nosa, it can never Nosa, be forever. It change. And then all of a sudden, $96 later, yep. I'm like, dude. Jason, you're on the other side now. You can tell us the dirty secrets. I can. I can. And I and I would if you want me to. But I, <laughs> I, I we have to also, because I, I always sat there and I was in the call center for a while. And I used to just lower my head in frustration. And I'm like, people have to know that things change they know that their wage changes every year to every year they get that that wage bump 
every year the gas is a little bit higher. They know every year the products that you buy in the store is cost a little bit more. You know inflation happens. Inflation is a thing. So if your bill goes up and it changes five or ten dollars, suck it up, man. It's well, let me know. <laughs> let me know. <laughs> you know, at least let me know. Yeah. Hey, know. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's let's touch on that too because we do let you know. Well, I'm saying we. Oh, like still like how come I you? Because because you know, my, a lot of people, you did. Maybe no. you did. So check it out. So you said let you know. So how many times do you get uh, your bill in the mail if you're a paper bill and you had these additional papers in there and you disregarded and threw it away and just looked at your bill? How many times did that happen? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and then how many times have you, uh, if you're on paperless, if you do your, all your payments online, do you, you go on there discount. and you look at, when you, you get, get a notification on there, do you just skip it and you go right to paying your bill? How many times does that happen? See? And Never if you're always complaining, oh, but you didn't tell me. If you would have told me, at least it would have been on the case. Well, maybe you should pay attention, mother freaker. <laughs> 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 That's oh, what man. I say. That's what I say to that. Basically, but yes, but I, it does happen. So yeah, people care. are, are duped no and sometimes more. and sometimes the salesmen they do tell you, hey, yeah, it won't change. And then they know they're giving you a promo and it's gonna change. So yeah, there are li liars in there. Yes, there are people who just want to get that sale. Uh and so yeah, that's gonna happen. But for the most part, if you know that because you can all it's if you go on the website, it's all there, to all the pricing. So they, you should be able to follow along. Oh, so say, no, this is everyday price, and this is not a promo. I want that price. So it's the same all the time. It changes every day. Pay attention. It changes every day. It changes every day. Look at this price. Oh, no, 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 no. It was 50 cents cheaper yesterday. Now it's... Oh, so you're going to complain about 50 cents? Heck yeah. Hey, 50 cents every day adds uh, up, dude. Well, every day, yeah. But you're not looking at a daily bill. You don't get a bill every day. No, 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 so if you no, if no, you no. got fifty cents difference from month to month, just pay attention. But I I want to know like my Come cell on, phone man. bill, okay? You know? My cell phone bill. It's the Come same on, thing man. every I'm year. I'm a penny picture, every, dude. Every month, it's the same thing. My cell phone bill. It never changes. Cause that's my, that. That's that. Even my like even my my gas bill and my heating or my electric bill. What's like, the difference? Those go up a little bit, but not crazy amounts like why does that not happen with internet service providers like why is there why is it such a drastic change from year to year other than a a, a another utility bill that i have because there's, be a that, of, Batman. there's a lot of there's a lot of local taxes that goes on behind there it is for, for television. there it is right there local taxes and oh, that's yeah. their excuse every time. And what are all that's the local a real taxes? thing, though? They're all just stupid little, like, I don't know what they are. I, I'm not gonna pull up my bill to look at them, but it just irritates me. Comcast, because stuff. With, with fiber, you could provide so much more than just a gigabyte per per household. Yeah, way, oh, way this is another more. This is another but one. They chip you and they, they say, Oh, you got. Oh, you're so many people you're on this service, on your blah, blah, blah. you're gonna have to pay this much for this type of exactly. service. Exactly. So to yeah, because if like, you guys think about dude, that, think about how much money that takes to 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 put fiber everywhere. Think about that. How much money does that cost? Oh nah. my goodness. And then, so you guys are saying, okay, so you guys want this new upgrade, but you don't want your bill to ever change. <laughs> Come on. You know I'm that so, if you get that, it's going to have to go They trained you Come well, on, Jason. Man. I just tell you this. They trained no, they you Mick, really think, good. You're... Mick, think realistically. Do you think that they can make that upgrade they... and your price never changes? You think that that can happen realistically? Yeah. How many new customers do they have on a daily basis? And how many do this they is lose a on a daily basis? This contract that you had with me, right? Yeah. And how many do they, they, if to, if they come they in have and they never and they provided good customer service for me that's why i don't that's why i don't upgrade my service to anything new because you're probably calling them all mad and pissed off and stuff no uh, i get i call them and, and, and then, then i get pissed off because i'm sitting there talking to some dude in the middle of india trying to tell me what to what to do and then i get so mad I, can i please talk to somebody that speaks english can i please talk to somebody because obviously what i'm saying isn't being transferred over to you so please can i talk to some and then after like six transfers over there they bring me to somebody like you jason where i could explain my issue get it over to you and then get my situation handled right 
You know what I mean? A lot of all my calls would just go straight over there. I'm not saying that's a bad thing or anything. I'm just saying it, it, it was, a bad that's, thing. A, that's, that's, I mean, for every situation, I'm not talking about just my situation. I'm talking about like every situation. There are probably people over there that provide good customer service or whatever, but every single one that I've had, every interaction I had was just a mess. It was chaos, right? Anyways, besides that fact, yes, it costs a lot of money to put fiber everywhere, but how much money are these guys making? versus how much money they're putting out these cable companies i'd like to see that all right it's a uh, give me give me give me and you can have a little bit of this little, i little mean bit. to be honest that's with everything though yeah no you know i mean? know that's but it. i'm just saying they do it a little bit more than other than people like i said with all this fiber going through there they should be making money yeah. out of if they are doing a lot, though. I mean, as far as money, they're they're doing a lot of partnerships with apps. I know that they're because they're putting them on their that that box that the X one box that they got. Yeah. So they they've a lot of it's been going to partnerships. Right. So I don't know, man, but yeah, I, I get you. I get the, you. And it's like micro transaction and uh, it, micro transactions exactly. in games where they're trying to penny pinch every little, try to get every every penny out of you. The other hey, thing it's like that one of our business, business that, man. You got to maximize like one of your our, budget. That's your basically profit. what I was going to say. Basically, one of our buddies that we were or that we know, right, told mm -hmm. told me because he owns a business. He told me when you got a customer in front of me, in front of you, if he got five dollars pocket, your goal is to get all five dollars out of his pocket. Yeah. So you say, I want to accept ca five uh, uh, cash only. You, and then you put an ATM in the thing in in your establishment, and then they go take out five dollars. I know it's twenty dollar bills, but you go take five dollars mm -hmm. out of the out of the machine. The people that own the machine gets a dollar, and then the shop gets a dollar, right? Then he comes back up, come back to you, right? And he says, "What do you want? A burger? Okay, that's going to be three bucks." But you don't even say that. Okay, cool. You want bacon on it? Yeah. You want out avocado on it? Yeah. You make it, he eats it, and then he gets the bill. Hey, why I got two two dollars on here? Well, the bacon's a dollar and the avocado's a dollar, right? And then yeah. the next thing you know, that guy ain't got no yep. money in his pocket. Yep. Right. You penny pitching, penny pitching, penny pitching. When you know that burger is only worth the three dollars <laughs> he went into the store to get it. Probably not even that. These companies are penny pinching everywhere they could go without you even knowing. Yeah. Like the ATM thing, I didn't even think about that. That's another, they're taking money out of your pocket mm -hmm. on purpose. They don't it's, need it's it. How you, it's how you succeed, man. It's how you keep your business. That's why they're yeah. in business still. Exactly. It's, <laughs> it's, it's harsh when you're on the, the, the rough side of it, but of it. That's, that's how it goes. See, Jason, okay. I, well, agree. That person... I agree with everything you're saying. I just don't want to agree with it, okay? <laughs> That's what I'm getting at. <laughs> right, right. Have a breakfast I know. talk. I know. The, okay? the experience service of it is, is horrible. everything. Service, service is, is everything. everything. Is. You're right. I agree. It is. Yeah. But it sucks, though, because we deal, you know, we have, we talk about Comcast. Like, I know it's Time Warner over on the East Coast, um, but uh, they have the best provider. They're the best provider. They have the best service, hands down. How do you know that? Because I've had everything else. Who? I've had AT&T, and AT&T is dog turd. But you can't say that. You can't just... Dog turd. Oh, I love You can't just process of elimination dude. just because these ones Garbage. are bad. That This one's good. You Comcast can't is like, it provides the best service, for, at least where I'm at. I've had... I wanted... I had consolidated communications, and that was good. Um, but they were just a small business, and they're going, you know, bankrupt, basically. And uh, AT&T is just no good. AT&T just put fiber in my neighborhood and I went with them and I freaking love them. I don't like Comcast. See, yeah. to each their own, man, because there's a lot of people who are on the other side of that spectrum. They Anytime I had any opposite. problems or anything, I call and they right then and there. I don't have to go through a million yeah, no, I, before I Comcast solve my sucks. I just want to go. I just want their good provide the service that they provide. Right. That's why I go through them. It's because I right. kind of have to. Right. So, 
Thing. Well, That's that was that. a fun. That was a fun. <laughs> I know, right? Uh, little spiel we had. Can't no. believe you guys made me defend my previous employer. <laughs> yeah, how dare dirt. you? You're not with them anymore. <laughs> Just throw them under the bus. Burn the bridge. I know. I look for every opportunity no. to do that, but still, now I'm realistic. And I look at things from both sides. Now. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. You're, I like podcasts, right? But I, I don't. <laughs> yeah, I know. I I'm with you there. I like them, but I don't. Yeah. Yeah. All yeah, right. Well, I don't like them for different reasons. <laughs> with all that, with all that said, I think we're gonna wrap up. Uh, pick your internet service provider and go eat your breakfast pizza taco, whatever the heck that meant. <laughs> Pay attention to us on on Facebook. Uh, so we're gonna re- release our uh, weights. <laughs> That's a weird way to say that. We're gonna show you guys how much we weigh on Facebook <laughs> this Monday. Today, when this episode, there's, no, there's no good way to say it. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna roll with it, 100. <laughs> percent And uh, and we'll show you some pictures and <laughs> what's wrong with me. Um, and uh, so go follow us on Facebook, facebook.com forward slash the Geek Retreat. We have a Twitter page that you can go follow at at Geek underscore Retreat and Instagram the Geek Retreat and a YouTube channel. We just started a new series on our YouTube channel that is uh, it's a it's a kind of like a let's play let's watch deal um i'm playing through a game it's called the a plague tale and mick and jason are uh providing commentary to my poor gaming skills <laughs> making fun of the actions i make apparently i can't react to death so i just <laughs> let it happen uh so go check that headlights. out yeah a deer in the headlights so there's two episodes up as of today when you're listening to man, I thought your screen froze for a second. <laughs> As of today, uh, when this episode's released, there are two episodes up, and there's one more coming on Wednesday. Um, so we're gonna release those every Wednesday and Friday um, for the Let's Watch thing, Let's Play, Geeks Play, and uh, our podcast will come out every Monday. So three days a week, you'll be wow. having new you guys are gonna get spoiled content are gonna get... coming. So we are trying to ramp up what we're putting out, and uh, we enjoy it. We enjoy you guys listening. If you're on, if you're listening to us on any kind of streaming platform, uh, iTunes or uh, Google Podcast or Spotify or Radio Public, iHeartRadio, any one of those, make sure to leave us a like, subscribe to our channel, and leave us a review. It helps us a lot to get exposure. Um, and tell your friends about us. Go, uh, go, say hey, I'm listening to this sweet podcast, and you should listen to it too. We appreciate it. So we're going to let you guys go, and we'll see you on next week's episode. I am Steven. That's Mick, and that's Jason. And we will catch you guys later. Bye-bye. Later. On the flip side. <laughs> sold, I sold Jason's. He stole it, man. Sorry. It's my stuff. Here, ready? Hey, no! <laughs> Got it. No. <laughs> <laughs> Woo!